Tonight, Maine is edging closer to becoming the 37th state to allow sports betting. But there is a lot to figure out before any wagers are placed. Here's what we know right now. The law legalizing sports gambling in Maine went into effect back in August, and it clearly draws the line on who can bet. Maine's native tribes will have exclusive rights to mobile and online betting. While well, the state's two casinos, Oxford and Hollywood, will offer sports betting to their customers who are there in person. This morning, the Maine Gambling Control Unit took the next step, laying out proposed rules for what that may look like when the time comes. News Center Maine's Caroline LaCour has the details. When someone pulls out their phone here at Season Sports Bar in Bangor, it's either to check a text or an email or to Google something to settle a bar bet. But in the next upcoming months, folks might be able to do something else, make a sports bet. And folks making a lot of money placing those bets learned a little bit of what the ground rules are going to be. So to be truthful, we are all learning as we go. A learning process as the Maine Gambling Unit lays out the groundwork for what sports betting in Maine may look like once it's allowed, maybe as soon as April, that is if everything runs smoothly. Basically what is happening today is opening the door for conversations. A conversation for a hearing scheduled for later this month once key players have a chance to review the proposed rules. A lot of them are being practiced in six other states already in the game. Things like protecting player data, physical requirements for in-person gambling, and programs that promote responsible wagering were priority concerns when drafting the rules. Milton Champion is the director of the Maine's Gambling Control Unit. Nowadays it's in play bets, it's over, over the internet, Okay, there's geolocation, there's age, age verification, all those elements that make it all that much harder. Looking into responsible gaming is a big thing. Um, that's probably the biggest concern. New to the team is recent Husson University graduate Kyle Borgett. He'll be working to review any concerns or comments key players may have. Those comments will play a part in how soon official rules can come out. If we can solve those in the beginning, um, then it'll be smooth from there. From June 2021 to July of 2022, bets placed by people in neighboring New Hampshire totaled nearly $24 million in revenue for that state. Champion expects Maine to see around 4 to $7 million in revenue. Hopefully it'll be a happy medium, uh, but I think looking at New Hampshire will we'll probably be close to the $6 million figure. If all runs smoothly, the unit hopes to finalize the rules by March 3rd. In Bangor, Caroline LaCour, New Center, Maine.